up you guys it's your girl nika pretty blessed and i'm back with another video today i am doing a mukbang as you can see from the description i am eating a philly cheesesteak it's called the broad street bully and i have pastrami also in here and i had them put some mayonnaise and mustard um they are a small business here in vegas so if you're ever in the vegas area check them out this is um their flyer so yeah and here's the info down here all right, so let's get into it. This thing is huge, you guys. Like, I can barely even pick it up. It's, the stuff is falling off of it. Lord Jesus, it's like so much stuff on here. All right, let me pick some of it back up and put it on here. Let's see, you guys. Look at that. Oh, amazing. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's really, really good. Mm -hmm. This has hot peppers, banana peppers, onions, bell pepper, um, yeah. and the onions and bell pepper are um, cooked. Mm. So good. Mm. There are so many toppings on here, you guys. This is, um, the owner is from Philadelphia, so it is pretty authentic tasting. Mm. Give me a napkin. I would have to say, this is the most authentic tasting um, Philly cheesesteak that I've had here in Vegas. And it's the best that I've had here in Vegas. I've had a couple um, different places, um, places in California and here, but this place is the absolute best. Got some onion rings here. Uh, probably see it better, onion rings. Nice and golden. Has a little crunch to it. If you hear anything in the background, I have Aaliyah and Jules in the background. They're eating too. Oh yeah. So tasty. Mm, so good. It's so messy, you guys. Oh, no more now. I think I'm probably only going to be able to eat half of this with so much, so much, so many toppings and so much meat in here. And it's probably because I got double meat too, you guys. I just went all out today. It's like, why not? It's the new year. Happy New Year's, everybody, if I didn't already tell you. Baby Leah wanted to say hello. She's over there eating her steak sandwich. All right. She's so cute. I am so cute. I'm trying to pick up the toppings and put them back on there again. Now she wants to talk to me to Debbie's eyes. It's so slippery, It's too slippery. 
All right, so toppings are still falling off, you guys, just overflowing with toppings here. Mm. One thing I can say for sure, you definitely get your money's worth. Man, so you guys have any New Year's resolutions out there? Any, I'm drinking water. But yeah, any New Year's resolutions or any things that you're looking forward to in the new year in 2021? Let me know. Go ahead and drop a comment down in the description box. I mean, the description box. Go ahead and drop a comment down in um, in the comment section. But yeah, so for me, I really don't have any New Year's resolutions. Um, I did gain some quarantine weight, as you guys can tell. So I think that I'm definitely going to be in the gym this year, taking care of myself and my body, you know, trying to stay more active. Um even though I'm still in the house. <laughs> but yeah, I went to um, went to a gym, met with a trainer, and he set me up on a program. So I'm going to be doing that, taking some more classes. So you'll probably be getting some fitness vlogs um, about my days when I get ready to go and probably take you guys to the gym with me. Um, but yeah, that's what's going to be happening. I'm thinking about trying a keto diet. If anyone has done a keto diet, um, go ahead and leave your information below of uh, different places where you bought great tasting food. So if you know of a place, or an Amazon link or something where you have purchased um, something that was really great keto, let me know. Leave the info below. Um, but yeah, I tried keto a few years back. It had to be like maybe about seven years ago. So it's been quite a long time. And back then they didn't have all that great tasting stuff, all the great tasting stuff that they have now. Um, they really didn't have much. I was finding myself eating a lot of salmon and shrimp and salad. That's basically what I ate. Um, but, I mean, I pushed through it and I lost the weight, so it was all good. But I definitely would like to know about all this new stuff that's out now. So I'm going to be researching, doing my research on that. And if you guys have any great suggestions, like I said, comment it down below. Girl, I can't stop Mm. This was a lot, you guys. But it was definitely bomb. Definitely bomb. See, still plenty of toppings in there. Probably take some toppings off of this other one and push it on there. So many doggone toppings. Mmm. Toppings are still falling out. I'm telling you, if you come to Vegas, this is a must try. All right. Mm. Lots of onions, lots of pastrami, lots of hot um, banana peppers. That was good, y'all. And I'm actually kind of full because that was a pretty hefty sandwich. So, I'm gonna eat this onion ring and I'm gonna have to wrap it up. All right, y'all. So that's pretty much it for today. Um, 
again, if you want to try them, it's called Straight from Philly. And here's your info. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe down at the bottom if you're not already subscribed. If you are, hey, what's up? Thank you for joining us. And I will see you next time. Peace and love.